Vince Gacron's here in Life on Earth. Give away, buddy. I will hit you. Sorry about that. Um, this is a little bit of a news update on the whole uh, Russian US problems in the Mediterranean. This is a, this is a two day old report, I think. Give me a second. Let's see. Yep, two days old, but uh, still relative. So, according to this report, which was uh, done by, uh, oh, who was it done by? Reporting by Andrea Shella, Shalel, however the fuck you pronounce that, edited by Susan Fenton. Um, according to this report, <clears throat> Russian naval activities have started to become a little more increased since the Cold War era. And uh, the U.S. are quite concerned about it, and rightly so. This way. There you go. Now you can get a good look at this. And uh, it seems like uh, NATO finally pulled their heads out of their ass and started building uh, new submarines, uh, mainly Poland and Norway have pooled the resources to uh, start building new ones. I think that was who started. Uh, give me a second. Uh, oh, sorry. Germany and Norway. They're building new submarines. NATO has built up physical forces in Poland and the Baltic states. Uh, let's see. Uh, Russians are doing flybys on U.S. And allied vessels at sea, and uh, Russia is pretty much saying uh, the NATO recent movements have uh, are starting to become a provocation, and we all know that Russia will probably retaliate because Putin's nuts, and uh, in this report, let's see. This one's three days old. Uh, apparently, North Korea is warning the nu warns uh, a nuclear strike if uh, provoked by the U.S. Try to be very careful. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. These are all top trending stories. Also, in that report that I just looked at, um, the U.S. are quite convinced that the Russians, with their uh, cyber attacks and propaganda have been trying to influence the election of the US so all that being said we are putting in a little dash of this a little bit of propaganda missile attacks we've got build up of forces all to make a nice big stew of war all because Trump couldn't keep his nose out of business that had no which he apparently wanted to be a U.S. president, not the leader of the free world, but decided to drop 59 uh, Tomahawk missiles right on top of Syria. Good job, Trump. You may have just escalated the whole situation uh, into a war. That's just my personal opinion. Uh, I, if everybody's watching this, uh, keep your eyes on the sky because it could get more brutal. More and more stories have been coming out. This one uh, is from the Reuters World News. And that I check it out if you want. There's tons of uh, good stuff in here. Long story short, as far as I'm concerned, uh, we are heading right for a war. So far, the U.S. have been trying to uh, figure out, because North Korea actually poses the biggest threat to Hawaii right now, where there was uh, lots and lots of fallout shelters. Uh, they're trying to figure out which ones are useful and which ones aren't, because uh, North Korea could have ballistic missile capability with tipped nuclear material. So, with all that being said, we got a big problem on our hands. Uh, It's coming down to the line of uh, whether Trump's going to back off and stop trying to piss people off and uh, whether Russia is going to cool their heads down and North Korea is going to finally look at their situation and say um, maybe starting a nuclear war is probably not a good idea. I wouldn't count on it. But 
Who knows? Maybe cooler heads will prevail. I figure we've been heading down this road quite a bit, and uh, it's about time it happened. So for all you people, uh, read some of these reports. Uh, the best one I suggest is, uh, let's see if I got it up here. Um, yeah, this one right here. It's posted uh, today, two hours ago. And uh, it's actually got some pretty good stuff. Uh, mainly focus on this one because if you live in Hawaii, you might want to know about this. So, uh, yeah. This one was uh, the Honolulu Star Advisor. Yep. Oh, no, 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 no. Dun, dun, dun. Whatever. So I suggest if you want to see how this is all going to go down, read that report. It's a good one. It's from military.com. Uh, go to the Guardian and uh, Reuters. And uh, again, Honolulu, I'd seriously look into this. All citizens of that of Hawaii in general, just look into that into that report. You might want to figure out what is suitable for a fallout shelter. They say any any building that has a good, strong concrete foundation with a good ventilation system. Um, I wouldn't try to build your own fallout shelter. That probably wouldn't work too well, um, at least from your own designs. I'd look at previous fallout shelters that have worked in the past. Uh, you can probably find it all over the internet here. Um, let's see. I even look here. All other shelters. Look at the images. And you got some good designs here. There's one there. Do, 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 do. Like I said the biggest thing is you gotta be, be able to make this thing uh, be able to survive radiation. And it's gotta be concrete because it's the best thing that'll survive a nuclear blast. Um let's take a look at I don't know. Something that will really work. Something that will really be nice. Uh, oh, that one looks nice. Let's see if we can find a good solid picture. Though. Ah, there we go. Let's bring that up here. Oh, nope. No, no, no. Uh, You broke it. Yep. Anyways, uh, go online. Go online, check out all the fallout shelters, designs that you can find. There's blueprints all over the internet. And uh, do yourself a favor. Keep your eyes on the skies. Watch over the warnings. And uh, hope for the best. Because frankly, we're looking at a bad situation. The Russians ain't helping the problem, North Korea ain't helping, uh, China really isn't helping at all because the U.S. are putting too much strain on China to try to rein, rein in the, a country like North Korea. It's just not going to happen. North Korea is their own damn country. They're going to do as, do what they say, and that's it. China gets involved in that business. They may turn around and just get nuked. So my suggestion to everybody out there, uh, when this starts happening, we're going to have to rely on each other to kind of survive. So I wouldn't try being a dick. Because uh, it's going to get ugly. It's kind of in the cards. We're going to build the full dead deck right out and figure out what the hell hand we've been dealt. So uh, <laughs> good luck. Me, I'm probably going to get started building a fallout shelter because I am not getting nuked. All right. That's it for this video. If you like it, then like, subscribe, share. I've noticed that uh, my views have been going up, so thank you guys. But we, I kind of need you guys to, if you haven't subscribed already, subscribe as soon as you can. And share this content around. Tell your friends about it. Tell them. Well, what do you got to lose? So, anywho, that's it for me. I'm Gekrons. I'm out of here. Uh, hey. That's more like it. Okay, 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 stop. Yeah, as my castle. See you later, guys. That's it for this video, and take care. Good luck.